Hello and welcome to another Sunday Cartoons with Dan Letha. I am cartoonist Dan Letha and today we're going to draw one of my favorite birds, the secretary bird. And uh, it's going to start out as a, a loose sketch and I'm going to go very fast. In fact, I'm showing this being drawn at four times the speed that I actually drew it. So the, uh, the secretary bird is actually one of my favorite birds. I have a number of favorite animals and I remember looking at pictures of the secretary bird when I was just a kid and just kind of it was so odd and different uh, because it's a bird of prey and it has such long legs and then the, the head looks so different with those uh, spiky feathers coming out of the back of its head and just the look of its face. Um, it's awkward and it's strange looking but it's it's cool and uh, one of the things that this bird hunts is snakes and uh, this is a, a bird that you find over in Africa um, and they're very 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 good at at hunting snakes in fact those long legs this animal was designed to uh, to kick with those legs it um, it has a very, very fast, um, a very fast kick. And um, in fact, it can have a, a force of five to six times their own body weight. And the kick is so fast that it happens in 15 milliseconds. The foot can go from uh, a, a still position to making contact with its prey. So that's lightning quick. A snake doesn't stand a chance when it gets kicked by that uh, by that lightning fast leg that, that God has designed it with. Now, keep in mind again, this is after the fall, so it uh, a, a bird like this, um, should there have been one like this in the Garden of Eden, wouldn't have uh, hunted snakes or other animals, but um, that's what it does now in this fallen world, and it does a very, very good job of it. Um, and they, they hunt other things too besides snakes, but that's uh, one of the coolest preys uh, that I think that they have. Um, they also rarely fly. Um, they have big wings and, and yet they, they hardly use them. They, uh, they use them when they do their mating dances and then they, uh, they use them to fly up to their nests. Now their nests are at the top of thorny trees which makes that very interesting. I think that's very protective for the young to be up in a thorny tree because no animal is going to climb up to the to the top and get this thing. So, um, and again, they uh, they lay, uh, let's see, two to three blue egg, green-blue eggs, or blue-green eggs. So, um, again, it's just a very odd bird. Um, one of the sad facts about the, the secretary bird living in this fallen world is that it's one of the birds that's an endangered species. Um, it seems like a lot of my favorite animals seem to have somewhat of a endangered species thing to them. Um, you know, uh, as far as cats go, I like cheetahs and I love gorillas, mountain gorillas. Um, those were the kinds of animals that, uh, besides dinosaurs, that I grew up really liking and I would draw them quite a lot and uh, the secretary birds one of them I love birds of prey in general um, I don't know what it is about them they're just um, d they're designed to do um, you know they're designed to kill obviously but um, the the tools that God has given them and designed them with to do that task in a fallen world just makes them neat the, a lot of them fly really fast um, like I said the secretary bird really doesn't fly that much um, but uh, again, it's unique from all other birds of prey in that it, uh, it has these long, gangly, awkward legs. But yet, it's super graceful when um, it's walking around and, and doing what it needs to do to, to get its prey. Now, <clears throat> as I'm painting on this thing here and kind of finishing it up, um, the last thing that I'm going to draw is its prey. And um, do I... Do I draw a snake? Uh, well, we'll have to wait and find out. It's coming sometime soon. Just finishing up some of the, de the smaller details with a, a smaller brush. And oh, here it is. Yes, in fact, my uh, my drawing of the secretary bird is uh, it's got a snake because that's what it's most famous for catching. 
and uh, it doesn't uh, seem to fear the venomous snakes. It'll just go over to them and whack, 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 and they're dead. And it's got it's got its meal. And uh, again, that head is. If you've seen pictures of the secretary bird, they um, they're cool and beautiful and really funny at the same time. So I I just really love the the secretary bird. Um, it's one of the most unique birds of prey that there are out there. One of my other favorite favorite birds of prey is the harpy eagle. That's another bird that I just love. Um, so I've got a number of favorite animals, and a lot of the birds happen to be birds of prey. Uh, again, they're just something cool about the design of uh, the beaks, and uh, a lot of them fly really well. Peregrine falcons, love those. Super fast animals. I love cheetahs, super fast cats. So, um, so I'm just kind of finishing up the shadowing and and uh, putting a, a grassy background there with a sky that makes that bird pop right out. And um, it was a fun drawing to do. So thanks for joining me today. This is Dan Letha. Have a great weekend.